it's Dub Block 23, and uh, got a little package for me, Bomey. And we had a little bit of an accident with the roof rack logger here, and I just went ahead and had to just bust her open. Had just a small little pinhole in it, but I sucked her down, and now we've got three quarters of a beer left here. It's uh, from Bent Paddle Brewing. It's their Vienna-style lager, and it's called Roof Rack Lager. Okay, and it says uh, here on the side, This end of paddling season comes with a sense of bittersweet. Just like our roof rack lager, this Vienna style lager plays malty with a bit of toastiness from Vienna malts and dry hops from Mandranzia Bavaria hops. Hoist your craft to your roof rack and enjoy this festive lager from Bent Paddle. And it's a, uh, let's see here, do we have a ABV on this bad boy? Yeah, it's 5.7 alcohol by volume. 5.7. All right. Let's go ahead and take a look at the pour here. Well, let's get a nose on it here first. Uh, the nose, uh, it's real, uh, I can kind of smell the kind of wheat or kind of like, uh, I don't know, like tall grass almost. Kind of grassy and a little bit hoppy. Let's check the pour out here. Oh yeah, it looks kind of grassy here. Okay. Not much head on that there bad boy. But uh, quite a bit of good bubbles here. And well, the smell kind of got a little bit sweeter after we poured it out into the glass. It's uh, yeah, it smells kind of sweet like a like a fresh morning, like a morning dew, like a fresh sunrise or something. And let's go ahead and uh, cheers to y'all for hanging out here. And uh, cheers to Ebony for sending the uh, tasty brew. And uh, let's get into this bad boy here and get us a pull. Ah, oh man. It starts out at you real crisp and just runs over the front of your tongue you don't get the burning on the edge of your tongue and then the dryness it all just kind of bread biscuit dries as you as you swallow it down the back and it's not overly dry but it's got kind of a bready kind of a you know nice hoppy bready finish on the end there let's see if we just take a little small sip uh, the flavors are more pronounced when you kind of sip on it and you kind of get the uh you get them v vienna hops i guess i kind of shouldn't have really read the the description there because it kind of gave me some you know some obvious points to start there but it's uh pretty tasty pretty tasty and uh yeah my man he bone me there he uh hooked me up with a couple of magnets here and uh some Damn nice Hornet Fixer swag. Got some good old Hornet Fixer swag here. Hornet Fixer for Prez. Hell, I'd vote for him any day. You got my vote, my friend. I mean, Obama and this Bahama Mama shit he's got going on just ain't working out. I'd vote for Hornet Fixer in a heartbeat. My vote's for the Hornet Fixer. Let's go ahead and get back into this here. There's not really no lacing going on. Mouthfeel is... Uh, it's light, light to medium, I'd say. Not much mouthfeel, not no lacing effect, and you can see the carbonation there. It's, uh, oh man, it's meant to be drunk hard. You gotta get you a good hard pull off that to, uh, really enjoy it. It, it kind of rushes down, and it gives you the whole rush of the sweetness a little bit, and then that bready finish, I'm liking it. For 5.7%, I mean, I could, I could drink this every day. It's uh, definitely not bad. We've got a whole bunch more beers to review, and uh, they're all looking better and better. This one was just kind of an accidental discharge upon opening the box there, you know. A little uh, premature uh, evacuation of the can here. 
and uh, just got just a little bitty pin hole in it there and had to kind of <laughs> shotgun style that bad boy but uh, you know I guess if I had to, to to rate this one I would go back to the IPA I just drank uh, Sierra Nevada's Hop Hunter and I'd say it was around an eight and a half and I'd have to it was 6.2 percent and this is 5.7 I'm going to have to put it at a good solid 8. I mean, it's a good solid 8. And, uh, man, it's good. Well, y'all be good out there. Behave yourselves. This is Dub Block 23. Y'all take her easy. We'll be seeing you. Take